This was generated using 100% free AI tool. Let's watch it. Tell me the truth. Were you with Claire last- Why would you even think that? Because she called me. She was crying, Miles. Lana, please. Don't jump to conclusions. Stop pretending, Miles. Just stop lying. Fine. Yes. It happened. It happened. I was weak. I messed up. With Claire? My best friend? A chance? Do you even understand what you've done to me? I know. I'll earn your trust back. No more lies. Ever. I'm not promising anything, but I'm not walking out either. Thank you. I swear I'll do whatever it takes. As you can see, the video comes with consistent character and the voiceover, the lip sync, everything is good. No distortion, no blurriness. And if you watch this video to the very end, I'm going to show you how you can generate yours in few minutes. Without further ado, let's dive in. We're going to make use of ChatGPT to generate our story, our prompt, and our dialogue. So open the ChatGPT app, and this is the prompt I gave it. Generate a short story in a dialogue format between a husband and wife. The wife accused the husband of cheating on her with her best friend. The husband tried to deny this at first, but later confessed and ask for our forgiveness so it generated the image prompts and dialogue for each scene so it included the location where the scene takes place and the conversation that happens between both parties then i told it to give me a specific prompt for each of the character in this story and it actually did that but for me the prompt description it gave me was too long and too detailed so i told it to make it short and descriptive so it won't just write it in a bullet point it's going to write it like you're talking to someone now copy each of the prompts and take it to whisk ai this is whisk and you sign in with your google account and just click on enter tool cancel this and paste in your prompts right here choose the aspect ratio and hit the enter button and this is what it generated for me and i'll just click on this second one and i'll download it go back to chat gpt copy the second prompt and bring it back here paste it here for it to generate the second character and once that is done i also download that onto my device by the left hand side click there then click on the upload image we're going to upload the first image then we're going to click on the second one and also upload the second image once they've successfully uploaded the next thing is for us to go back to ChatGPT and copy the image prompt of each of the scenes so we're going to copy this and take it back to whisk ai then once you go back to whisk ai make sure both of the images are ticked tick it there and then paste in our prompt here this will enable us generate consistent character for each of our scene so i'm going to paste it here then we'll go back to chat gpt and copy the image prompt for the second scene the third scene fourth scene until we are done with copying and creating all images for all scenes the next thing now is for us to take all these images to grok ai for video animation and lip syncing. We are going to be using the web version of Grok for this. So go to Google and search for Grok. Click on the very first link and sign up with your Google account. It brings us here. The next thing is for us to go to the settings. There's a settings we need to adjust there. So we'll click on the profile picture at the bottom left corner and you click on settings. Then you click on behavior and then you turn off the auto generate video option. Once you're done with that, click on imagine. Once you're here, before you enter your prompt, click on this video option, select your aspect ratio and select video. Make sure it is on video. Make sure your desired aspect ratio is selected. Click on this attach button and click on upload a file. Upload the generated images from whisk. And then let's go back to chat GPT to copy the dialogue for each of the scenes. Then we'll bring it back here. Before you paste it, make sure the video option is still selected and your aspect ratio and your desired aspect ratio is also selected. Then you click on enter. And within a few seconds, this video will be ready. Grok AI is one of the best video generation platform I've ever seen. 
and it is super fast. We are going to repeat the same process for all the rest of the images we have generated, pasting the dialogue, selecting our aspect ratio and making sure that we selected the video generation option and before you know it, all our video will be ready. Sometimes you might have to generate it more than once to get your desired outcome. AI is not perfect. You are the one to control it. The next thing now is to take all the generated videos down to a video editing platform. I'm going to be using CapCut for this and we'll just upload all the scenes. And then because I generated some multiple times, I have to cut and join, cut some places that I don't like and join and also add transition in between the clips and also add an animation at the beginning. Once all that is done, I'm going to go to adjust, click on adjust and click on sharpen. Then I'll sharpen this video to 50% and then we'll export this video. It is that simple. I'm sure you got value from this video. So please do well to like it, subscribe to my YouTube channel for more awesome and amazing content like this. And if you have any question or any video you would like me to create in the future, kindly drop it in the comment section. Also, let me know where you're watching me from. I would love, love, love to meet you. Till I come your way next time, I remain your girl Zara and I'll see you in my next video. But before you go, do well to check out some of my previous videos and you will not be disappointed.